There's my antenna. And fed half wave. Nine to one on on. Lots of snow here. Even the grill is kind of feeling a little icy there. I would still use it in the winter. I use it all every week. Uh, us Canadians were uh, kind of like that. Okay, there's my RS918 from recent. We're monitoring FT8 on the 30 meter band. It's uh, about 3 p.m. local time. I'm on Eastern time in North America. I'm seeing a German station, several US stations. Uh, let's see. Let's have a look. Uh, way up. Let's zoom out a bit. Okay. Okay, just switch to 20 meters. I see we're picking up Brazil, Norway. Maybe I'll give a call out to Norway. I'm at the end of the cycle, so I'll have to wait for the next uh, go around. Okay, we're calling the Norway station, LA-1 PTA. Running 15 watts. All right, let's see what happens. Whoopsie daisy. Sorry about that. Calling again. If he doesn't answer this time around, I will hit uh, halt. I don't like to uh, transmit over and over and over and over and over and over. If he can't hear me, he can't hear me. All right, so, uh, and somebody else is actually on the same frequency. So let's uh, abort that. Let's talk about uh, what we see on the screen here. So um, here is the um, the band spectrum um, where you see the little yellow underline right over here is what the, this SDR is actually letting through on the band pass you can see the band pass here is set for 3.2k band pass filter that corresponds with that yellow line and corresponds with all the FT8 signals there um, even though it says up here, you'll see up here where it says 500 hertz. That is not um, the band pass. Um, that is the tuning. That's referring to my tuning resolution. So if I was to turn the tuning knob, I'm going up, see, 500 kilohertz. 500 hertz, I should say. 
That's what that is. So, let's see, at top left, I've got my uh, crystal oven on with the TXCO, TCXO, rather, running at 39 degrees centigrade. Uh, my audio frequency gain at 14, RF gain at 20, RIT zero, and uh, noise reduction is at three, but it's disabled right now. Otherwise, it would be in orange. And uh, that's so that explains what's on the display there. Well, what else is on the band? I think the frequency might be a little bit off on this rig. You're gonna have to calibrate it. That's a few hertz off, and that guy's probably spot on. Okay, well, just a uh, toodle, just toodling around on the band. If I find anything else interesting, I'll add it to the video. Okay, well, not too exciting a video for you today. Sorry, uh, not too much on the happening on the bands, and uh, but I'm still enjoying this little. Uh, SDR. So um, stay tuned. Hope to see you real soon on a new video from the Radio Hobbyist.